Okay, today we have another video from Aussie Man Reviews. Um, okay, here. Um, last time we watched the drop bears, which were the koalas. Um, this time we are going to be. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> this time it's going to be magpies. Um, so I think I've never seen a magpie in real life, but the thumbnail, I've seen them in like really old cartoons. I didn't know that that's what they really look like. The thumbnail, the thumbnail had a good picture of magpies. Very pretty, very pretty bird. Um, but the lady's face in the thumbnail uh, is quite funny. So I'm excited. I love Ozzy Man reviews. I, I don't know. I just think he's very funny. So I'm excited. Thank you, Damien for this video. Righty, so a few weeks back, I said the domestic cat was nature's asshole, but you know what? <laughs> I was wrong. Well, cats are dodgy, but they're nowhere near as bad as a swooping fucking magpie. I'm not even joking. Look at this bird, ready to consume your mortal soul, looking for eyeballs to poke out, like Toby Green from GWS. They sit up on power lines, acquiring targets, and bam, flying out of trees, taking on entire families. We're struggling to reduce carbon emissions, because none of us want to ride bloody bikes down here. The evening news puts out apocalyptic maps. It's like <laughs> being in Command and Conquer, Red alert is that real? too. Oh, this wombat testicle I ripped out is tasty. A bit salty, but tasty. It's in the eyes. You can just tell this guy is a shithead. He hears a human and off he goes. I'm going to get you once. I'm going to get you twice. And just when you think I'm done, I'm going to get you a third time. Like their cat cousins, they don't discriminate. How you going, dog? Fuck you. Oddly placed pelican? Screw you. Much scarier looking bird? No worries. Piss off. And Piss off. Double swoop. The postman, fuck you. Why are you delivering junk mail? You're meant to bring legitimate mail. Actually, could you check if you have my Amazon package under the name Maggie Smith? It should be a vial of worm-flavoured vaping juice. Oh, and I also ordered a jar of Belle Delphine's bath water. Using a fast mode of transport doesn't save you. These little two-toned bastards can still catch up to you. Let's look at me split screen. Sweet Swift, relentless strikes to the head. At least he's wearing a helmet. Unlike this galah going in without protection. Oh, fuck off, you fucking slut! Oh, you fucking slut! Look, I'm gonna blame the victim. He just shouldn't be outside in spring. I stay inside for two to three months every spring. I develop mental health issues, but a personality disorder is better than a magpie attack. This Sheila is onto something quiet, crafty, using a piece of tree as a prevention method. Look at her it face. looks like it works. Oh no, it doesn't! The fucking magpie is gonna be extra angry now. The piece of crap camouflage has fallen <laughs> off. The Maggie is like, you think you can trick me? That tactic might work on a drop I just bear, know but what it's not gonna saying. work on me, lady. You're a goner. Look at this one, lulling a puppy into a false sense of security. Oi, mate, I'm your buddy. You've got a friend in me. Nah, I'm not scratching and biting your face and body. Yum, this peg is tasty. Hey, what are you doing? Me? Nothing. I'm definitely not sizing up your lower intestine, imagining it decorating the nest in which I'll raise my brood into the next generation of merciless killers. Nah, not doing that. Wait, I hear something. Cunt bird away. Now again, I'm not trying to paint in broad strokes. Hashtag not all magpies. I'm sure some are being naturally defensive oh, of I'm their homes. The They're not inherently evil. Okay, this magpie is flying away with puppy intestines in its beak. So yeah, this one is evil. Confirmed asshole. Look at his eyes. Okay, that was fun. That was funny. So um, I have to know, is it really a serious issue? Do you actually have maps that tell you where to be on the lookout for large swarms of magpie? I don't even know if swarms would be the right word, but anyway, that's crazy. Um, the birds around here are just usually scared of people. They don't, they don't, they're not aggressive like that. <laughs> Um, even the, the big vultures that look scary, they still don't want to be around you. Although we do have, um, geese. That's a different story. The geese around here will chase you, hiss at you and try to bite you if you 
go anywhere around where they're nesting. And it just so happens that they always want to nest in the places where I have to park my car. So it's like a chase down every whatever season that is. So that was a lot of fun. Thanks again, Damien. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. Leave your comments. Leave, ah, leave your thoughts in the comments below. And I'll see you next time. Bye.